everyone welcome back today we are going to create an C sharp project in a macOS ecosystem now I have a 2015 15 inch MacBook Pro this is very uh, kind of basic one 16 gigabytes of RAM and 500 gigabytes of SSD <coughs> um yes i'm still using this and i also have mac mini with the m1 series if you guys want to i can also test the c sharp with the mac mac mini one it is with the m1 version now um i usually use visual studio not the visual studio code but i know some people don't like to use visual studio um on a macbook so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use Visual Studio Code instead. <clears throat> so I'm going to open up my project. Be sure that you have C Sharp extension already installed to your computer before you start. Now I'm going to come here, double click on the top here, on the top double click. It says select a language. I'm going to go ahead and choose C Sharp. Now, I want it to run on a terminal, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use .NET 3.1. So I'm going to say using system <coughs> and <coughs> uh, using system.threading and class program and uh, public static void main string arcs okay I have those ready and what I need is here is that I'm going to create <coughs> another static void I would call print. So what I'm gonna say is I'm gonna say something like that instead of double quotes string texts. Okay, I will have texts inside of this uh, variable type string for each variable text in texts. I'll go ahead with this. <coughs> My bad. So inside of here, I will say console dot write. I will say text and thread dot sleep. We can say fifty. Fifty is fine for now. And yeah, this is it. You will see what this does. We are going to create a chat bot, kind of like a chat bot, okay? Um, since I don't want this video to be too long, I'm not going to include the list. And checking the list, if it is inside of the list, I'm going to just get the word and say things. I don't want to do that for now. I'm just going to go for easy way. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to say while, while, true. When it while it is true, <clears throat> I'll say try and try catch exception x if we, we want to call it if something if we want to call it <clears throat> so it will say print uh it'll get a string value inside hello there i am here to help you how may i help you today today so we're gonna go one line below then we're gonna say this <coughs> uh, let's actually do this in the beginning
let's take it to here okay and we are going to be given chance to reply in here in this place okay now <clears throat> okay I'm gonna leave a space here now I will say uh, Uh, let's go ahead with a string option equals to console dot read line. So we are actually going to read the line. If uh, option equals equals to high, which they can also write it. Uh. <coughs> Which they can also write its upper cases string option to string uh, I will call it a um, option that to lower we're gonna take the lower case of it and instead of option I'm gonna go with a and we're gonna say if a equals equals to high then we are going to say something like this. I'm gonna say print uh, hello. <coughs> then <coughs> we are going to console dots read line. Sorry. <clears throat> okay, I'm better. Console dot read line. <clears throat> now, after our user presses some key, we're gonna clear the console, uh, and we will keep going with this. Okay, and before this, and before this, what I want to do is how um, may I help you? instead of this I'm gonna take this to here okay save then <coughs> a equals equals to how are you uh, we're gonna say print I am glad you asked it I am perfectly I'm perfect or I feel perfect right now what about you <coughs> And we're gonna do the same things again. Console dot read line. I just want person to see uh, what it says before we clear it. The reason I'm cleaning it is I want a clear screen. If you don't want to, you don't have to. So each time I run it, I want a clear screen. That's why I'm keep clearing it. And yeah, actually, no, not this. Let's go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> uh, is there any way for me to run this? Okay, start debugging it maybe. Is there any way for me to open a... Um,
open a terminal here I guess not okay new terminal oh okay there is there is a way now I want to save this first before we go with something okay uh, save as I'm gonna go with program dot cs to desktop and save this and I have the file here <coughs> then we're gonna go to desktop ls mcs program dot cs so since we didn't use this, it's us. It wants us to use it. Console dot instead of console print x dot to string. We can say, or you can just delete it if you don't need it. It's totally fine. No, not this. Quit. Okay. Now I'm gonna go here again, try MCS. Okay. Now we have we have a program exe now. As you can see, there is no exe. We have an exe file here. We're gonna say mono program dot exe. Hello there. I'm here to help you. How may I help you? So it wants us to enter something to it. I'm gonna say hi, hello. Now, if I press enter again, it will clear. How may I help you? It will keep asking this. I'm going to say, how are you? It says, I am glad you asked. I am fe I feel perfect right now. What about you? So if I just press it again, how may I help you? It will just keep ask and ask and ask and ask. So I'm just exterminate the program. Let's go ahead with else if. Uh, a equals equals to I am also good right if we say that uh, we can just say something like this print I am glad to hear that I always want you to be good something like this right <coughs> So I'm gonna just save this before I do it. Um, oh, never mind. Okay, is it saved here? Okay, okay. I'm just gonna write it again. CD desktop, uh, MCS program, CS. I have to convert it again. Program dot exe. Hello there, I'm here to help you. How may I help you? I'm gonna say hi. Hello. Uh, we're gonna say, How are you? I'm glad you asked it. I feel perfect right now. What about you? I am also good. So. It ran this, but since we didn't place those two, it went to beginning very quickly. Uh, that's the reason we also add console read line <coughs> before we clear it. Right? So we have to save this again and run this again, but this time. I'm not gonna go for every every single word. Program.cs, mono program.exe. Um, how are you? I'm glad you asked it. I feel perfect right now. What about you? So, since it's asking for us, I'm gonna say I am also good. Oh. <clears throat> I'm also good. Oh, that's that's the problem, I guess. That's the problem. Okay, just to ex um, exterminate the program. We don't need it again. 
cd mcs program.cs mono program.exe <coughs> Are you? <clears throat> I am also good. Okay, the problem was we typed I uh, with the uppercase since it is trying to make it the lower that is having confusion up there. So since we get this to lower case it's fine it's working fine without the problem so as you can see this is a uh, very simple chat bot very very simple one but if you want to <coughs> say something like goodbye or exits for example you can also exit the application with that command if you want to. We're gonna say break. Okay. One last time, I'm gonna show you guys. See the desktop. MCS. <coughs> Oh, sure, sure, okay. A equals equals to exit, my bad. Now, CD desktop. Okay. MCS. Mono. I'm going to say exit and we are out of the application. Thank you for watching. If you guys want to learn more or if you guys want me to code on M1 Series Mac, I will do that. Uh, thank you for watching again. You guys have a great day and be safe.